Uh, we are getting a closer look into a deadly crash that killed five people in December, including three children. 41 Action News reporter Lexi Suter is sorting through these reports. And Lexi, a lot of new information on this crash. A lot of new information, Krista. Investigators believe the young mom who was driving the car didn't react properly when her car began to stall. Now, investigators also say the semi driver who hit her should have seen her car. All right, now you're looking at video of that crash, which happened on December 27th. 24 year old Chante Hopkins was driving on Interstate 435 when her car began having mechanical problems. Now, according to witnesses, she was driving in the very far right lane, very slowly, almost to a stop. Some witnesses say her emergency lights were flashing. However, the crash reports say her hazards were in the off position. The semi truck driver says he never saw her car and he rear ended it, killing all five people inside. The family of the passenger in that car, Dominic Johnson, filed a wrongful death lawsuit against the truck driver, two trucking companies, and the parents of Shante Hopkins. The report also notes that Hopkins was driving without a license and she had cocaine in her system. But an attorney for Hopkins' family says that test could be a false positive. Reporting in the newsroom, Lexi Suter, 41 Action News.